Hi, this is Bob Rubart from the Oracle Technology Network, and I'm still here at Oracle Open World. It's Tuesday. Things are as busy as ever, but the sun is shining and all is right with the world. I'm here with Steve Blackwell from Avacent. Steve, tell me about your role at Avacent. Well, I'm the Vice President of Engineering for Avacent. Avacent is, an Emerson Cor- is a part of Emerson Corporation. Um, Emerson is a global manufacturing and technology company. It's about $24 billion in revenues last year. 135,000 employees. Avacent is a manufacturer of hardware and software solutions for data centers, particularly for management and control within data centers. Okay, so let's get technical. Tell me about the Trellis Project. Well, the Trellis Project is Avacent's DCIM product. Um, DCIM, Data Center Infrastructure Management, is a relatively new market. It's roughly $2 billion expected to be in that market by the year 2015. Um, Our Trellis product is a product that helps our customers optimize availability, capacity, and efficiency within their data centers. We've built it as a a single product that helps manage IT and facilities uh, systems together. It's a highly scalable product, and it helps um, to manage both the the distributed hardware that's out in your data center, brings it all together into a single software platform where the IT and facilities managers can work together to optimize the system. So this isn't something you guys fluffed up over a weekend? No, absolutely not. Um, This is, is, um, so far, about three years in development. We've been on the market now with this product about a year and a half. Okay, so what Oracle technologies are involved in Trellis? The Trellis product is built on the Oracle Fusion middleware suite. So it uses a variety of, of Oracle technologies. Um, the WebLogic suite and the service bus are kind of the basis of data handling within Trellis. Complex event processing, the OEP product, is used for alert management um, out in our distributed hardware, and then coherence is the latest addition. Um, The coherence system working with WebLogic um, is gathering disparate data from a variety of sources. It's synchronizing it through uh, top link with information that's in the Oracle database. And for all of that, we're supporting real-time views of data in a very scalable, very broad system, but bringing it together into one single location for real-time views of that information. And what's the progress of it so far? Well, we're doing very well so far. Um, Trellis is recognized by a number of people as the leading product in the DSIM industry. Um, We've had a number of significant customer engagements, a number of significant wins, and we are seeing very good utilization. Really, this is a product that helps our customers because with the use of Trellis, we're helping them to lower energy costs, we're helping them to optimize the utilization of their data center, and we're helping them to increase operational efficiency. So are you speaking here at Open World? Absolutely. I'll be speaking um, in, a, in a coherence panel later this morning, um, another discussion on coherence this evening, and then a, a discussion on CEP and a variety of other topics tomorrow morning. Well, Steve, sounds like you're a busy guy, but thanks for taking time to talk to me this morning. Thank you very much. This is Bob Rubert again from the Oracle Technology Network. Stick around the OTN YouTube channel for more videos from Oracle Open World 2013.